Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. It's Theoni with Thrifty Divas and I'm here with another pretty large Dollar Tree haul once again. And I have broken everything down into category. So I know I've been sparse, but if you watch me, you know, I had some uh, pretty big things coming up and uh, I did have a trial this past week. Uh, it went well, if you're wondering. I know a lot of you were wondering and said good luck. So my clients were facing a max of $25,000 in fines and I got them to 2,000. I was hoping for 1,500, but it is what it is. They seem to be pretty happy with it. They just shrugged a lot and was like, nah, whatever. Um, so yeah, that's it. So, all right, let's uh, get on with this haul. So I have all like my mini categories here first. Oh, and also by the way, today is my filming day. So how many do I have on deck? Four, we'll see if that happens, but I have four videos on deck for today. We'll see if it happens. All right, mini categories first. So the first category is gonna be like party stuff. So I showed these in a walkthrough. They had several different designs, but I thought these were really adorable. They kind of felt nautical to me. So they are this three pack of treat sacks by Voila. And this one I picked was the like natural color with the navy blue stripe. I love that. And I think three for a dollar is awesome. And they are four by six. So I just got one pack of those. And then they had this. I don't think this is distributed by Greenbrier. It says nothing about it. And you know it would, right, if it was. So this is 10 sheets <clears throat> of gemstone holographic tissue paper, which is just the glitter kind. But this is gray. How cool is this? I thought that was like slightly unique. So I got two packs of that. I really like that. You don't see grays and things that much. And then I picked up one more bag for the baby shower I have to go to next weekend. This has glitter on it, if you can see that. So it just says, a new baby girl. And if you watched my last haul, um, I have a Batman bag as well with just the Batman logo that I'm gonna put pink tissue paper in because that was a lot of the stuff on her registry was like pink superhero stuff it's really cool but anyway all right so that's it for party then let's do accessories and apparel so the first thing i found was this the perfect glove this is also not distributed by greenbrier this is by global glove a safety man and global glove and safety manufacturing um i i looked it up they're a company in minnesota they're not like crazy expensive or anything, but they are more than a dollar. But I got those for my stepfather to try, even though I feel like they're more like gardening gloves, but whatever. And then I found this. So I had gotten the one that was a bow in gray last time, but I got this big flower one that I found now in gray to add to the baby gift. And then for me and for one to save as a gift, they had these. I also showed this in a walkthrough. This is the Sincerely Jewels by Scunchy. And this is a an elastic headband, double stranded with these gorgeous rhinestones on there. Those are like legitimate rhinestones. I don't know if you can see them, but they're pretty amazing. And it's on like a whitish gray satin absolutely beautiful so one for me one to save as a gift well to add to a gift you know then i just got a few shirts for my son i got another one of these construction worker yellow ones that i absolutely love in an extra small that's gilded and then i got this neon orange one extra small by gilded And he's just growing so fast. Everything like that I just buy is like small on him. I, I can't even keep up. But anyway, so uh, this is also Gildan. This is a 6T that might fit him for a couple weeks. Don't know. 
I give up. I don't know. This is a 6T as well. Yellow T. And then I found, this is a little bigger. This is Fruit of the Loom Heavy Cotton. This is a small, long sleeve. So that should probably be just about right for the fall, I'm thinking. Can't, long sleeve shirt. I can't, for a dollar. It's amazing. And it's 100% cotton. Yeah. All right. So that's it for apparel and accessories. Told you these are the mini categories. Then next I just have a couple of books that I thought looked cool. This is the Super Duper Dog Park. This was just $4.99 retail. Balloon Tunes. It says visit us at blueapplebooks.com. I just thought it was really cute. So what it says on the back is, Simple stories illustrated with zany cartoon art guaranteed to engage and encourage new readers. Then I got this for my husband for Father's Day. Big Game, the NFL in Dangerous Times. I have no idea, but I think he'll like it. Retailed for $28 US. And then this is for me. Now a major motion picture. I've seen it. I've seen it too. This retail for $7.99 US. HarperCollinsChildrens.com. So this is Scary Stories 3. More Tales to Chill Your Bones. Look at the, the cover. I've seen that. I've seen it. It was in the movie. All right. Yeah. So I this is like one of those. <laughs> so it's all little stories. But this is like one of those that like I'll read in like. 45 minutes poolside if that you know I just think it's fun so I'm very excited about that I love mindless stuff because I read too much not mindless stuff all day long so yeah I love that stuff and that's it for books not much this time and then let's move on to stationery and jot and teaching tree and that whole aisle so this is by crown jewels and I actually picked this up for a kind of tie-dye hippie slash package that I'm making for a friend of mine. And you get five sheets of stickers. This was from the Stay Wild set uh, that was like tie-dye and mandalas. I showed that in the last walkthrough if you wanna go check out the other items there. But you get five sheets of stickers and they're pretty darn cool. You have Stay Wild, Moon Child, Free Spirit, Peace and Love, and then you got some tie-dye mandalas and peace signs and flowers and you know so that was cool uh then i picked up a two pack of tape and then i picked up three of these two for me one for my mom because i think she'll find something to do with it this jot reusable gel tape so it is three quarters of an inch wide and you get 40 inches of it on a roll now I'm really curious if this is any good. Uh, I just spent $20 on alien tape. Yeah, and then they come out with this. So hopefully this kind of does the trick, but I think this is great for just certain things. If you need a carpet to stay down and stuff, like that's what alien tape is for because it's removable and doesn't damage anything. Hopefully this is okay and uh, doesn't damage stuff. But you could hang like canvases and stuff, pictures if it holds, if it's good, but we'll see. I'm excited to try that. And then I showed these in the walkthrough as well. And yeah, no, I had to get the Dr. Seuss ones. So you get 16 crayons. They are distributed by Greenbrier in this hard travel case, which is amazing. And the crayons are themed like the box that they're in. The, in the walkthrough I showed, they had Dr. Seuss, Sesame Street, Play School, and My Little Pony. So I got one of those for my son. And the very last thing in stationery and teaching tree, and that is this. And this is by Inkology, Boca Raton, Florida, inkologyinc.com. So not distributed by Greenbrier. It's like a foggy type plastic with this pink pearlized trim. It is a binder pouch, but I actually got this for me um as like a little snack bag to keep in my car 
because my blood sugar drops a lot of times unexpectedly. So I always like to have like a protein bar, some beef jerky, some nuts, things like that. And this was like the perfect size. So I thought that was cool. I'm just gonna keep that in my car. That's it. Yeah, these are mini categories. All right, and the next category is a little larger, but still not that big. This is going to be toys. Okay, so the first thing I picked up from the toy section, I got two of these. These are definitely new. 100 count building blocks by Make It Blocks, compatible with all leading brands, and there's four assorted colors in there. It says ages six and up. I'm just gonna hold this up for you to look at. This is what it comes with quantity wise, etc. But I just thought these were really cool to put in my Toys for Tots slash birthday party bin. Because that's pretty cool. So those are going in there. And then I picked up one of these eight packs of these light little plastic golf balls. Because if you saw a couple of hauls ago, I got that like um, cone basket shaped like popper with a ball in it. Uh, and I know that's going to get lost and I feel like this might work. So I wanted to get this as replacements because, sorry, that's Henny walking around. Um, the I know they're light enough to jump up from the click but i just hope they are small enough to fit down to the bottom but that's what i was thinking with those and then i showed these in the walkthrough as well so i got one for us and then i got one to save for a gift or something so this is not distributed by greenbrier either this is by amscan inc in elmsford new york amscan.com and these are truth or dare dice and they're really big and they're pretty heavy and they're they're super cool so you get truth or dare on there but then we can see some other things what's your biggest fear what was your most embarrassing moment post your most embarrassing photo shake a stranger's hand and don't let go make up a rap about the person to your right what was the last lie you told? Ever peed in a pool? When? Where? I don't know. That would be a fun drinking game, but I don't drink. But I just thought those were cool. How, where are you going to go? What if you're like, where are you going to go shake a stranger's hand for and not let go? Let the group give you a new hairstyle? Oh, that was fun. Okay. Then I picked this up. I'm going to send this to you, Gina. Hopefully you don't have it, but you know, if he does, I know at least with my son, they can redo them at that age, whatever. But this is really big compared to the ones that we've seen in the past. This is by Wood Shop. You get the paints, the little brush, a string, a string. I don't know if you can see it. A string comes in this one to hang. And this is a nice little space scene with an astronaut. And Gina, you got to let me know if he ever stops like in space <laughs> for starters. Okay. And then I saw uh, my friend Sadie. I got a few things from Sadie. So my friend Sadie over at Sweet Sadie J TV, SWT, Sweet Sadie J TV, showed these in a walkthrough. I think, and then she bought them. But I was, I was like, I need to find these. And luckily I did. So this is by Mattel, not distributed by... Greenbrier. This is Mattel Canada. Uh, these are the micro collection and it's Jurassic World. So I found four of them. They're just on like little rock stands kind of. So this is the Dimetrodon. This is Velociraptor Blue. This is the Triceratops. And this is the T-Rex. So of course I got those for Little Man. And the very last item in toys I have been looking for this thing forever. And even when I was digging through them in the walkthrough and I was digging through the box, I'm like, again, they don't have it. But once I put the camera away, I dug back and there was one. So I've been looking for this thing for about a year. This is for my friend Patty's son, William, over at Patty's Chance Halls and more. 
you can go check her out if you haven't already. Tell her Theoni sent you. She's going through a very busy time right now as well. Very exciting stuff. So that's why she hasn't been posting as regularly, but she's still around. So this is the Disney Zoom Zooms Goofy for William because he loves Goofy and I could not find this at all. Last time I got her Minnie and Mickey, but could never find Goofy. So I'm very happy. All right, and that is it for toys. What, what do we have next? Okay, this is gonna be crafty items. Uh, it's two items, but apparently I bought many multiples. So this was on my wish list big time, and I knew I would have to travel to find it a little bit, and I did. Oh no, this one leaked everywhere. Oh no. That's probably garbage. Anyway, that's bad. Anyway, okay, let me stop digressing. So this is the Crafter Square 0 0.7 ounce glass etching cream. I got like four of them, but now I probably just have three. So somebody said in the comments of the walkthrough that it sucks, but I saw a few videos of people using it and it looked pretty good and they said it was pretty decent for the price. So I'll give that a shot with some stencils for fun, for gifts and stuff. Very excited about that. And if you saw like maybe two hauls ago, I don't even remember anymore. When I talked about Jot that one time having these pens with a brush on the end that actually had the paint builds in. And then I found something by uh, Ink, INC, hoping it was the same, but it wasn't. It was a brush marker that wasn't really a brush. Anyway, so then you guys started telling me about these. I looked into them and I was like, I need these. They moved up on my wish list very quickly and I was hoping to find them and I knew I'd have to kind of travel for those too, but I found them. So these are going to be absolutely awesome for my son. Hopefully they don't leak. I don't know, but at least we have this going on now. Uh, oh, and I actually saw a crafter uh, talking about how she puts her Mod Podge in here. I don't, I feel like, I don't know. I feel like it would harden. I'm not sure, but that might be really cool because it's already built in but i think i got like four or five packs of those because i got super excited and couldn't control myself and then i was like who knows if i'll ever find anything like that again in the next three years so that was it for crafty items just two things but multiples very small categories so far killing it time wise if you guys knew how much money i spent and how quickly this might get done you'll be like wow um, all right, so the next category is going to be food. So I blame my friend, not blame. Thank you, Sadie. So I saw this uh, from Sadie over at Sweet Sadie J TV as well. And this is the Duncan Hines dark chocolate fudge brownies. I was very excited. So once she showed those, I knew I had to find those as well. This is the smaller box, makes an eight by eight pan, but dark chocolate fudge. Okay. You know, just in time for the 4th of July. So I'll save those. When do they expire? August 16th, 2022. Yes. All right. Then I found these. I only got one. I probably should have gotten more. I should have gotten more. You don't hear me say that ever. So these are good until March 8th of 2023. And this is Star Snacks packaged in the USA, but the peanuts are from USA, Argentina, and Mexico, starsnacks.net. And this is a huge bag of roasted and salted party peanuts. Nine ounces. This is really good. So if you buy peanuts, check this out, grab it. You know, the little containers that they sell, those are less than nine ounces. So this is a better deal and you can refill your containers of, of peanuts if you've gotten them from there before. So should have gotten more. And I was looking for more of those four ounce cashew pieces bags because that is an amazing deal. And there's so many uh, halves in there, like not just broken pieces. Couldn't find them again though. I'll keep looking. Oh, I blame Sadie for this too. So I found this in the original and I was only seeing original for ages, but then Sadie showed um, apples and cinnamon and I was like, oh, that would be cool to find. So this is the Autumn Mills Instant Oatmeal. You get six pouches in here and this is apples and cinnamon. 
no high fructose corn syrup, no artificial flavors, no preservatives or sweeteners. And this is made in Canada. So got one box of those. And then this is the last food item. No, it's not. <laughs> I picked up three more of the 50 piece Tic Tac fruit adventures. These were so good. These were really, really good. Um, they have cherry, orange, passion fruit, and green apple in all of these colors. So that was like really fun. And I really enjoyed munching on those. Like I'm a smoker. So like when I can't smoke and stuff, those were like really fun and satisfying. It actually had me thinking like I could, I could see myself like using, you know, utilizing those to aid not smoking. I swear. All right, then I was very happy to find this and I'm sure little man is gonna be just as happy. I got them for him. I've never seen this before. This is Libby's Diced Mango Fruit Cups in Light Syrup. So you get three four ounce cups. So that's even bigger than the non-Libby ones. Those have gone down to like three or three and a half. Yeah, that's pretty cool. I'm very excited. I got three of those. They're good until February 10th, 2022. And that is it for food. And now we will move on to the next category. It's getting like really overcast out. I hope it's, hope the lighting ends up being okay in this. Um, so the next category I'm gonna do is housewares and such. So again, I know you're probably getting sick of me saying it, but if it's your first time watching me, housewares to me means everything from decoration to cleaning to plates and bowls, etc. everything. So let me jump into this. So the first thing I picked up was this Main Street Wall Creations wall sticker. Again, this is not distributed by Greenbrier, these Main Street ones. They are made in the USA. And I got this mermaid one for the baby shower that I'm going to, just to add to the present, because if you guys remember, I told you um, the actual invitation said like a mermaid is coming or something like that. So maybe she'd like that. Like maybe that's the design she's doing. I don't know. Is one missing? Wait, no. Oh, I thought these were missing for a second, but they're, they're just silver. Okay, moving on. All right, now, hold on. Let me just, so again, if you've been a long time watcher, this is one of my favorite things on earth <laughs> when I find these. This is the bonus. You got six instead of four Glad 30 gallon trash bags with Gain Original Scent for a dollar. So I did find these again and I picked up a few boxes to semi re-up because I always get a few so I don't run out ever again. Um, and then this is a repurchase as well. If you saw my, I think it was the last haul, I was very happy I found these Gain fabric softener sheets, 15 count, but they are in the Island Fresh scent, which is, which is something special. And it's something particularly special to me. You know, they say smell is the sense most directly uh, tied to memory and I'll vouch for that all day long. So I picked up two more of those because I was mad at myself for only getting one when I found them. Then if I get, if I'm a person who gets excited about trash bags, poop bags, printed paper towels, things like that, official adulthood. I was so excited when I found these. I think I got five because I feel like I'm not going to see them. So I was actually on the hunt for pretty much this or something very similar for over a year now because I saw somebody haul, I saw one person haul something very similar to this over a year ago and we never got it. We did get like coffee cup ones, which I loaded up on for a while, but check this out guys. 
So this is like their normal napkin pack that they have um, made in the USA. But not only is it the bonus pack, so you get 180 instead of your usual 150, these are printed. And these are printed with, you're not gonna be able to see them too well because it's pretty faint and my light is cloudy right now, but I'll show you the picture. They are printed with multicolored butterflies. Can you see it? I don't know. I can never tell till I go to edit what shows, but yeah. I was so excited. So yeah, I got like five packs. Welcome to adulthood. And then I was very happy to find this. They call it a cutting board, but no, I just got it for like the center of a table or something. I don't know what I got it for, but I had to have it. They had the square one too. I opted for the round um, just because of this. And I don't know. I'm not a big fan of the saying, but it doesn't really matter. I love that truck so much. So yeah, I just picked up one of those. And then these are all repurchases. I am gonna finally set up my whole thing with the square sand bottoms and all that. But then I realized for my shelf, and if you've been with me for a while, you know the whole shelf thing. I built that and everything. Um, but I think for summer, I wanna do this stuff on the shelf. So I kind of repurchased them all. So I got the little, little beach house here. I got this this shell house I got this shell house I got another one of the Volkswagen Beetles with the surfboard on top I got this beach chair and another boat um, they had no more of the blue Adirondack chairs left but whatever but yeah I'm gonna put that up on the shelf for summer amongst some other things but when I bought them to do my little like mini setup I was thinking about it I'm like oh I should have gotten more to do the shelf with so I'm happy I found them again then they only had one of these left it's this really pretty hanging mason jar or you don't have to hang it but I thought that would be very nice with a little candle in there out here and then I picked up this to save, to add to a gift for my mom. I showed all of the different ones of these in a walkthrough. So pretty with the little tassel and stuff. Wood top with cork bottom. This one smells really good. I never expect anything from the throw because these are distributed by Greenbrier. This is Prosecco and Rose though. So, you know, I had to get that one. It does smell very, very nice. And I got two of these. Um, I might put these up on the shelf also just for the summer and then put them in my grease bin. Because again, if you've been watching me, my goal is to transform all of my bedroom in Greece from roses to all seashell and nautical stuff because it makes more sense but i found this little anchor and rope led light and it does it stands like this so a little tilted and then they had this really pretty lighthouse one and then the third one was a pirate ship and i'm like that doesn't really go with my theme. So I got those. Uh, and I think, oh no, last thing in home stuff. I really got drawn to these dish drying mats. I thought they were fun. So they're navy blue on the back and then they have like a red and white plaid with a navy blue trim. And in my last walkthrough, I showed the whole set that goes along with this. It has writing on it, but they have the towels and the oven mitt and the pot holders and the whole whole shebang to go with with this all right that is it for housewares now i'm going to move on to like outdoor and summer so i purchased a few more of these 
expanding soils because I really did like them and I have a whole bunch of repotting to do. So I grabbed more of those. It's just, it's very easy. And then I picked up a two pack of the patriotic bowls for the 4th of July. These are great for chips or to like put your buns in for the 4th of July or hey, Memorial Day right around the corner. And then I found this really cool sign, this letter banner that says happy 4th of July. And then I got three of the buntings. I have purchased these before. They don't last longer than a season for me or more accurately, a 4th of July season. So it's even shorter, but they're really, they're, they're really cute. I mean, for a dollar, you know, whatever. I bought two of the super large hanging flags. So all along my um, deck here, I'm gonna alternate the bunting with those huge flags. Then, repurchase. I don't even know how many of these I've gotten now, but this is for Greece. So if you heard me say before, my, my room in Greece was all roses. That's how I decided to do it. And even my headboard. So my headboard was this black wrought iron headboard, uh, you know, with, with vertical lines. And then it had an image of a rose with leaves periodically throughout it. I painted it all white and then I actually hand painted the roses pink and red and then like did the leaves green so that they kind of pop out. So if you recall when I said that I wanted to switch everything to seashell and beachy nautical stuff, I was like, ooh, the headboard's gonna be a problem. So anyway, what I thought of doing is I'm actually going to take these and so now I have two two or three because I don't know how many roses are on there I mean my aunt and my uncle are staying at my house right now in Greece I could tell them to go shack for me but it's not that important but I think I'm just going to bring these and a tube of e6000 and I'm going to e6000 these over the roses on the bed frame to change the, the headboard to change it to that style. Yeah. That's my thought anyway. All right, then I got a whole bunch of like flags and wind socks and wind spirals. But for some reason, all of the paper tags were falling off, like all of them, all of them. So I don't even know what's happening anymore. I really don't, I don't know. So I got the wind sock with the truck, with the dog in the back. And I believe <laughs> this is the wind spiral. And then I got the garden flag with the camper that says bless the USA. And I believe this is the truck one as well. And then I also just grabbed one of these with the gnomes, Land of the Free. All right, so that is it for outdoors and summer. I found something. Yeah, so one of those flags was the truck. All right, so let us move on to the next category. We only have one left and it's a big one. So the last category is going to be health and beauty. Okay. A lot of multiples, a lot of multiples. So hard to tell, but all right. So the first thing that I picked up, these were new Epsom salt tablets by Assured. You get six and these are lavender scented. Add to bath when you have tired or sore muscles. 
easy to use, mess free, made with lavender essential oils. Oh. Those are cool. Ooh, they smell lovely. So those would be great. Pedicure bucket, whatever. I love it. I wonder if they'll come out with more than just lavender, but I thought that was pretty nifty. And then I also found this. This is distributed by Greenbrier. This is a hair color application kit. And it comes with the little mixing bowl and the little brush. Isn't that so cool? I thought that was cool for when I use like a uh, vegan, 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 B I G E N, or like henna type stuff. It's just good to have. So I got one of those. And then I found these. So now this is by Spa Works. Oh, distributed by Global Beauty, though. Global Beauty Care. So this is Pore Relief. If you watch me, you know I jump on anything for pores. Because I have big pores. So this is Pore Refining Makeup Cleansing Wipes with Aloe Vera and Tea Tree. So I believe this is like the fourth one I found now. Fourth different one. And then I thought these were absolutely amazing. I showed these in the walkthrough as well. Barbasol ear and nose trimmer with stainless steel blades. And it has the little cap there for you. Absolutely amazing. Amazing, in my opinion. So requires one AA battery not included, easily and comfortably groom unwanted ear and nose hair anytime, anywhere, and it has washable heads, just run under water for easy cleaning. So with Father's Day coming up, add those to little grooming kits. I think that is absolutely amazing. And then, I just got one of these, this Wet n Wild Mega Cushion. I think I just got one. No, I didn't. I did not. I got two. Um, so these are the color correcting. I got lavender and I got the yellow. So the lavender corrects yellow and the yellow brightens dullness. And then I picked up two, yeah, just two, you know, one to share of these giant, guys, these are so big. I don't know how to explain to you how big it is. Well, first of all, there's that uh, top of a mason jar. Yeah, it's like twice the diameter of the mason jar. So this is the Wet n Wild Mega Glow Contouring Palette in Caramel Toffee. And then I got several of these as well to share. So this is Hard Candy Glitterazzi Crystal Lip Duo in Sparkling Spice. So you get your glittery like gloss kind of in there and a super, super duper glittery lipstick in there. And I... I even love the shape of the lipstick. So cool. So cool. Okay. Then I picked up two. I don't need any because I have every scent ever made. <laughs> I'm not even, that's not an exaggeration. I have every scent ever made of Fox in a Box. Um, but, and I have the bronzers and the highlighters and like, everyone ever made I own um but these are the pina colada baked highlighters fox in a box so I picked up two um either to share or for a future giveaway uh same with these I picked up a couple of these this is the hard candy shine free all day oil free loose powder sheer envy translucent loose powder 0 0.63 ounces 
12 hour matte finish. Uh, then I got several of these. This is now I had I had multiples of the one that says uh, three times a lady, I think it was. Um, and that was more of like a blush kind of, it was like, it was, it was like pink and brown and white, I think. Um, but these are, this is a glow all the way contouring face trio in 840, three times a charm. So you see that? So you got a light, a dark, and then a highlight. I guess it's a very light, light contour. Um, then this is a repurchase for me. I, I, I am obsessed. These things are absolutely amazing. So this is made in the USA, Revlon Flesh Thick Stick Foundation, and this is in sugar. There was another one that I bought that worked for me, and I couldn't remember the name while I was there. But they have so many. Custard, pudding, vanilla. This one's sugar. I just love it. I absolutely love it. So this one is a, I think this one is a little light for me. Yeah, so it was the other one that I bought that was perfect, but I couldn't remember. I couldn't remember what it was called. I have to go look. But they're, they're just really good. They are so good. Um, okay, what do we got? And then I got a few of these to also share, of course, and giveaways. So this is Hard Candy Glitterazzi Prism Flip Liquid Eye Color. And this is in 1324 Aurora. I love, look at the packaging. It's so beautiful. So this is like, or I don't know if it's picking up, but in the light here, it's super iridescent. Picking up so many different colors. And how cool is this? See, it's little, it's like little, I don't know. Does anybody else pay attention to this? The stick is clear. And I love that for some reason. So this is eye color. Put it on a little thicker. Ooh, that is pretty. I love it. Oh, I love it. Oh. I just love it. You move, you know, you move and then it goes pink and purple and oh gosh is that doing it any justice whatsoever who knows and in this lighting who knows I don't know but I love it oh that's so cool okay all right all right moving on moving on I just got one of these for me this is the uh, eyeshadow single, Single and Loving It by Hard Candy. This is in 520, flirty. And what else I got? That might be it on the Hard Candy. Hard to tell because the rest are multiples. Uh, this is a repurchase. I got this um, copperware elbow sleeve as seen on TV because my husband, so I bought two the first time, gave one to my stepfather, and then um, my husband actually needed this the other day, hours, so I gave it to him, and then I was like, let me just have a backup because look, it already came in handy. And as soon as he put it on, he's like, it's tingling. Is it supposed to tingle? I'm like, that's the copper. Yeah. And then I picked up one of these for myself, this clear brush on nail glue by New Color. I love brush on nail glues. I prefer them. I got two of this ready in case uh, 12 liquid gels, all day allergy relief compared to Zyrtec. Uh, did I say how many? 12. I don't know if I said it or not. 
Yeah. And then repurchase. So if you saw my last haul and my community post, I realized afterward I was even more excited that um, at first I thought these were wipes, individually wrapped wipes, but they're little individual packets of hand sanitizer, 70% alcohol. And that is amazing. I don't know why I love that so much. I just do. And when I brought my son to um, the birthday party last weekend, I threw a few of those in my pocket and it was the perfect amount in one of those little packets for me and him. And it was just so convenient. All right. We have like four things left in this haul, guys. We did it again. Can you believe it? So if you saw my walkthrough, I was like, they had this bucket of all amazing nail polishes and I really had to control myself. So I got one. I got one and I will, if you're not going to do it, I will. I got one. Maybelline Color Show Holographic and this is in Bold Gold 45. They had me at holographic. So that was the end of that. Then I got just one of these. Wet n Wild Mega Glow Highlighting Power Powder. This is in Royal Calyx. Let's see. It's really pretty. It's like a bluish purple, silvery. Oh my goodness. Open. All right, I finally got it open 17 hours later. So it's this really pretty. Is this going to do it any justice either? I don't know, but it's so pretty. It's like a blue, purple, silver metallic. I can't even explain it. I don't even want to mess up that flower. <laughs> I'll be sad. It's so pretty. Um, It's funky. I like it. Okay. All right. And next, I just got one of these. This Spa Scriptions uh, Facial Cleanser with Glacier Water and Hyaluronic Acid, 5 ounce. Now, cruelty free. Now, my friend Gina said she threw it in the trash because she couldn't get past the smell. So she got me super curious. And then I was like, well, thank goodness I only got one. But then she got me super curious and I opened it and I smelled it and it doesn't, I don't know, it doesn't smell bad to me. Oh, wait. Hold on. <laughs> it doesn't smell bad to me. I don't know. Maybe it smells different when it's wet. It's, it's not bad. Gina, you had me scared. Maybe you got a bad one. Like, literally, maybe it was bad and old. I don't know. But, all right, that's not bad. But I only got one. It feels cool. What else do I have? Was that it? Oh, no. Okay, so I think these are the last things. So they have these new masks that are... <laughs> okay, so these are manufactured by Zhejiang Ugly Duck Industry Company in China. Planet Earth Eyewear, Hackensack, New Jersey, made in China. I don't know. So these are three ply non-woven filtering masks. I don't know. But 10 for a dollar. First we were paying two for a dollar. Well, first we couldn't find the middle. Then we we're paying two for a dollar and then we got lucky and got like three for a dollar. Now there's 10. 10. And these are way better than like the green and white box like the assured ones these you could just visibly see that these are way better so i got 10 of just plain black i got the black and gray plaid i'm loving loving this they had red and black buffalo check too but i just got the gray and black and then i got black with white polka dots i got this is the last one of the adults digital camo for my husband. And then I got these. This is a 10 pack for kids. Same, same company, same brand. And they had like a more masculine pack and a more feminine pack. The more feminine pack had like 
unicorns and leopard print and they had a whole bunch of cool stuff going on but in the more masculine pack we have the black and white checkered the flag which would be perfect for memorial day and fourth of july we have uh green camo sharks and then this one is super cool it almost looks like a notebook you know like somebody doodled on it it's like rock fun cool and it's got little sunglasses and guitars rock the world really cool so yeah i'm assuming you can get two of each if it's got five on there but yeah that that's it guys wow we did it we did it we did it we did it again okay so that is going to do it for today's haul everybody if you have not yet hit that subscribe button i would love for you to consider hitting it and becoming a permanent part of the thrifty divas family don't forget to like and comment because youtube analytics loves that sort of thing i have three more videos to film today we will see but that's what has to be filmed today. And until the next video, stay blessed, my friends. I love each and every one of you.